and welcome to Sexy Astrology for February 2013, the month of Do Not Be Afraid to Ask for What You Want month. Hi everybody and welcome to Sexy Astrology. The two words that you just can't stand All right, I did try today because we have a special guest with us who is uh, behind the camera and uh, hopefully won't get too much footage of my uh, back fat. But anyway, so here we go. How is everybody? Happy Valentine's Day. I have been many, many, many Aquariuses. What? What did I do? Oh, my skin. Yeah, you know what? There's problems. I had some um, greasy food over the weekend. Okay. Hello, everybody, and welcome to Sexy Astrology for the month of February 2013. As you can see, I put my special Space Girl eye makeup on today. My daughter approves of that. I got my, my jewelry. Okay. All right. Um, so this is do not be afraid to ask for what you want month. Uh, yeah, the sign Aquarius has everything to do with friends, power, power broker friends, and, um, everything to do with dreams and visions and your big dream, your dream big or die. So that's this kind of month. And for most of you, I think if you're moving in a good direction, most of us are feeling the benefits of Neptune recently moving into uh, Pisces and no longer in Aquarius. And oddly, that particular aspect is allowing everyone to kind of take a deep breath and take it in. And people will be having moments of euphoria and physical body um, good moments and also feelings of, oh my God, I can really get what I want and moving ahead, you know, and I keep seeing it. I see it in my life. I see it in other people's lives. And that is partly Aquarius. Those are the things that are ruled by Aquarius. Um, yeah. So I know all about this, all right? Jupiter is still in Gemini. But right now, this month, so this is like don't fall asleep and wake up, okay, is the month to go out and get more money. Um, and I have not taken heed yet, but at least I'm like cleaning up my room slowly, little by little. And um, But anyway, more money. Who does not want more money? Um, probably only a Gemini wouldn't want more money because they're so like, you know, up in the, up in the air with so many things. Um, but now is a good time to really like, if there's an opportunity, a small opportunity, jump on it, make them want you, make them go crazy for you and get the money and ask for the highest price. I mean, right. It's not going to hurt and, uh, sell it. You know, Jupiter in Gemini is nothing if it is not an, uh, completely crazy salesperson because Jupiter rules expansion and Gemini is the chatter, the chatter in the moment, which I am good at. 